everybody are we doing this morning hopefully we're doing okay hopefully we had a good start to our weekend nothing too crazy just a little bit just a little bit of trouble it's always acceptable i guess we'll say a little bit how are we doing today, chat? Are we doing okay? We having a good uh, good day? Good morning, good evening, wherever we're at. We're going to keep it rocking in our colony here. We've yet to see a bad tide. So we're going to try to get ahead of the game here today. Uh, it's kind of one of our big objectives. Uh, we left off. We kind of took advantage of this split here. Got a reservoir here for our trees. Build up our, our main reservoir down here. And we're building this up here. So this like other channel here. Bad time comes. We can kind of just block this off. Ship the rest of that bad water out this way. And it'll flow. We should have enough flow. Hopefully. Hopefully. Let's see, can we see how many? Ooh, it's a lot. Um, hmm. Hmm. We're gonna find out. Ooh, drought started. We're not ready. Uh, you. Are you up? Get you going. Okay, with a little bit of a little bit of spillage. And let's get you up. Water cuts off a lot quicker than you anticipated too, so I swear we were gonna have to build we're gonna have to build up to that, so it's okay. I'd really like to not have to build one step at a time, but it's okay. It's not terrible. And as soon as they get done building all of this over here, we can block this up. Should be. Why can't you guys get? Ah, uh, there's no block over here. As soon as they get done building all of this up here, put these blocks in. We are going to have to get up here, though get access to the other side so we've kind of blocked ourselves off i've said for a long time i wish they would make tunnel block sealed that our beavers can go in and out of even if it's like too deep give me a too deep one give me a good too deep one beavers can go through beavers right they go they go in and out of their dam i think that's plausible I don't know.
too deep. Even just the tunnel. That'd be cool. Uh, so we're working on this, right? And I know we got carrots and potatoes going. Um, and I believe we just unlocked the grist mill and the bakery. So I want to get um, take advantage of some of our green space that we have over here and get some wheat going so we can get bread working. So I want to get, let's look at getting these trees cleared out. If I take you, just put another guy, another beaver down here. Oops. Let's get all of this cleared out. We got our power here. Move the path up one. Hopefully, we can get a power shaft. Yes. We get our power up and over. Should only need a corner here. It's all our windmills. If we put any more windmills in, we should be able to connect them like this. And then get this built. So we got a couple trees left here that are gonna take forever to grow. Oh well, not too long. That one's gonna take a while. Oof. We're going to hold out on them because they're so big. Get eight logs on them. I don't want to just delete them. Need to get wrist mill going. I think in two of these. We can run I always get kind of confused like what am I doing wrong did I freeze the game already there's no way uh let's actually let's actually take this behind we've got a little bit of dead space We did this backwards. If we were smart, we'd put them back to back. So then I only have to drop power once. Do a little offset, then I can bring power in. And power into the front. What do we think, chat? Fill in the space there. This can be flower going out. Boom, boom, bringing it in. Put up a little bit of storage. That way we have wheat kind of localized. Chain, wheat, 
pain so these guys don't have to run too far. Let them get that built. Get that going. What are we doing over here? Oh, look at us. Heck yeah. One beaver with nothing to do. Let's build geo storage. Localized. You're going to supply as well. I don't know what you guys are doing that you're getting injured so quick. My goodness. For a second I was scared. This was was it too high? It's like no. Please no. Put that there. Because we're not going to be able to get down right there. We'll just get around the corner. Getting up here will allow us to come across here. Finish that up. Once they decide to get out there, we can get that done. This is definitely the high priority. Let's get you guys done. And then you, and that way, yeah, that way we've got, got that figured out. I'm debating putting another big water container here. Um, I like having two of them, at least until we're for far enough along that we can get large tank going. Um, but this is the closest scrap metal that we have, which kind of sucks. It's going to take a minute. That's a trek. I honestly don't know if one district is going to be able to reach it. It's getting orange up here, so it, I mean, it's going to be close. It's going to be real close. Speed this up so that these guys get things done. Gonna need. I want to do more of the farming down here. I, d I really don't want those berries. I think we're gonna just clean these out. We have the ability to plant our own. We honestly have too many, at least for the moment. We'll go ahead and put another one up here. Oops. Beavers, it's not like you have a billion things to do. But, you know, here's a couple more things. Just get it all done. Oh, look at you guys. Get it. Get it. Guess you probably need this prioritized to think you can get over there. Huh? I guess you really don't. Uh, yeah, to get this. And then 
end up getting here. You can't get that. Probably should have left this one open and had them finish that one first. Get it, beavers, get it. Looks like we're pretty max on population at the moment, so... Any future expansion is going to require... Boost in population. The builder's hut's pretty up there. The fluid dump is going to be up there. Upper Chef as well. Scavenger Flag, 250. That one's going to be up there. Yeah, we got a couple of them. So we might build a second Inventor Shack. We might get rid of this. Feel a population bump up. Oh, water's coming. We're about to have issues. So these need to go down to half. These need to go down to a half. Let's go down to a half. This can go down to a half. Oh, this goes down to one. Oh, oh, oh. I need to go to one. I'm going to have to play a little game of how do we balance this now? Because right now we're just flooding. We say it looks like that's going to be okay. So that's at a half, and that is at a half. Seem to be doing okay. So everything over here is built. I'm going to get rid of this. Maximum priority. Oh, look at that power. <laughs> Got almost 1,200. Crazy. You, let's put you at one, because then that should, should be the height of our blocks here. That way if things get a little bit too high, we'll start overflowing. See what that does. I wouldn't be surprised if our next cycle here gives us a bad tide. Did we not build stairs up over here? We didn't. That would probably help us get up here a little bit quicker. We've gotten extremely lucky on the bad tight cycles. For this being cycle seven, and we haven't seen the bad tide yet. One of the biggest issues with the bad tide is like the food, the food's not too bad, right? You can stock up food, it comes through. A lot of the stuff doesn't take too long to regrow. Build your trees. When it comes through and you're like, your oak takes 30 days, and that bad tide comes through and it stops growing, and now you're, you're, you know, you're taking 35 days. 
and then adds another five days and another five days. And it's just, it prolongs that out so much. And then the fact that the fluid dump no longer gets maximum range out of just dumping it into one square. So you got to be a lot more strategic with those, those two aspects. Everything revolves around you having wood. Thus, having a just ridiculous amount of wood storage right now. We're good, though. We should be able to block this up. Ship our bad, bad water out. I don't have to worry about it. I am worried about this overflowing. So, I guess we could test it with regular water before we. We're good. We got nothing to worry about. Nice. Nice. So that should work out quite. I'm scared to say perfectly in our favor, uh, but looks like it's going to work out exceptionally well. We're going to have to build some of these in places, but five planks and one metal, when you don't have, you don't have a mine to start off with, mm, expensive. Gotta put one on every block. You should be able to not have to line the entire river. Now when we get up here, we're probably going to have to do that still, but it's going to save us a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Doing over here, we get stuff through. Can we build this, please? I think we're at the point we do need to knock these two houses down. Get the bigger house in. Let's get a little bit more population. Kind of just teetering on having jobs and not having jobs. We're going to start Start expanding out a little bit. We kind of got just minimal industrial production here. We're going to open these up. We're going to get a whole other field going. We keep kind of bouncing back between not enough beavers, not enough jobs. I want to get, I want to get some backfill here. Which we're doing okay with right now, but not, not good enough. like to come in here. See how this is kind of cavernous? I'd like to get down in here and shore this up. Build a dam out here, out here. And then we could... Because that's what, two or three blocks tall? Three blocks? We'd probably get it three blocks tall. We farm this entire area here. Have food, f have food for days. What's our happiness looking like? Wet fur is low, shelter is low because we just did a thing. Campfire. 
food. We're about to get bread, so that'll that'll help them out. Aesthetics, we don't have any of that, and fun. So basic needs, we're getting close to filling those all up. And then nutrition. We're getting close on nutrition. Once we get things kind of stable here, with that kind of tipping point, bread will help out a lot. Get a couple more beavers. Should be able to start doing some more science. Be able to unlock some stuff. Kind of want to get the builder's hut. I think the scavenger flag is going to be the more important way to go. Because that's going to give us dynamites. Well, the bad water. Well, yeah, because the bad water needs metal. Yeah, so we should probably go scavenger flag next. Work on getting up and across. I would love to have double and triple platforms as well. So we don't have to build like six tall to get across. We'll get somebody working over here. Oh, I hate when I do that. We will this line up nicely. Sure. Then this is what I'm, what I'm talking about. I'd love. This would be a double. This would be a triple all the way across. Mark that for deletion. We just get it. What do we think, Trent? Do we do we get the platforms? I think we get the platforms. Let's go for the platform. Well, that's one higher over here. Ooh. It's okay, we'll just run a stair right there. Run triples through here. And then what we can do once we build here, we could actually put a dam. Lock up. Nope. Water will spill out. I guess we could still put a dam and then only block it up so high. And then if we need water, it lets them out. and It'll run down and around. That wouldn't be too bad of an idea. I do want to get this... Relatively close to the edge. I don't think we're going to be able to reach. Well, maybe we are. Surprises all around. Is this 200? Pretty close. I want to put the, the farmhouse like right here. Then it can get a good good reach on the area I want it to. I don't. I want to put more storage and working buildings in here. So I don't I don't really want its reach to go that way. I guess we could honestly put it here. There's some trees out, get a path down. 
here might honestly be a good spot too. Let's just do it. These are what, birch? It's like what, one log a piece? Set for one second. We're gonna just build a massive wheat farm. Maybe a little bit of carrots, because we tend to not have carrots. Ooh, we also need potatoes. I think we do I think we do wheat and potatoes. Um No, what do we think, chat? Do we care enough about carrots? Do we care about do we care enough about carrots to plant some more? I'd really like to get wheat going. Did we already populate all of those beavers? I feel like we should definitely get some more water storage. I'm going to change these to obtain now that we have the hauling post. I appreciate these. Let's me really get a grasp on how I want that to to be managed. Can we why are we not filling this up? It's too far away. You gotta build a path out there. That crops though. I'm going to build a path to connect these up just for our haulers to be able to make a loop around making a loop sign with my hand. You guys can't see. Um, and then we're going to do that so then we can get down here. And this is going to be wheat. This is going to be wheat. This is going to come down, and then I think we do down here. Took up a lot of our hmm. I'm gonna try to get some more potatoes going. Got started, I wasn't paying attention. Fuck you up. Lock you up. And you. And you. We're doing this all wrong. Water level over here is good. Let a little bit more in, fill that up. That's what this is for. Right? So we're, we're good here. It's blocked up. Good here. That's blocked up. 
no more is coming in, so it won't overflow. The rest of that can just go out when it starts looking like it's drying up. We'll close it. And then we have a little bit of water in there as well. We're going to do wheat here, and this is going to supply. just cleared out one on my paths oh did I rotate this the wrong way what an idiot I also built this back one too far so Guess that's not necessarily. Uh, an idiot move. I guess it's an idiot move. Do we? Still a tree there? Yeah. Okay. So we. Let's put a little bit of potatoes up here. And then let's do potatoes here. I think our path goes straight out. And this path, I think, is going to come here. Sometimes you gotta just look at things again and reevaluate. Right, so where all can you reach? Oh yeah, you can get it all. Nice. That should greatly increase our Props. Cool. cool. Especially the wheat, since obviously we don't have any. Um, boom. That also gives us another kind of route around. I'd like to build another way through here. Do we have enough to get the triples? Do. Let's work on getting this built then. What do we need? Another 250? Another 250 gets us up here. Triple floodgate will do it for us here. I think levees. Levees on the outsides, and then we'll do triple floodgates in the middle. Oh, and they built that already. Look at you guys. Heck yeah. There's another low spot here. It's okay. That'll, that'll just kind of backfill here. I'm okay with that. I was just worried about it overflowing down into where the, the colony is. Get it, beavers? Get it? Get it? Get it? And we still have yet to have a bad tide. 
It's very, very surprising to me. I honestly thought this was going to be a bad tide. It's just crazy. Honestly. Is that a berry bush? I thought I got all of those. You are empty, so we're going to get rid of you. You can go because we don't need you anymore. Don't have anybody here yet. Okay, we're going to get there. We got some beavers coming up. We don't. Where did all the beavers go? Did we not chat? Did we not just... Could have sworn. Could have sworn. We just made a bunch of beavers. Point five for you. You are good there. It's You're good there. You're good there. Everybody should be okay. Those are the levels. Yeah. I've seen mods. Um, I think it uses the steam gauge and it can hook up to the double flood or the, not the double floodgate, but all of the floodgates. And it controls, like, you can set, like, presets where you don't have to <laughs> run around and do this. And you set the little stream gauge next to it. And then you're like, oh, when the drought hits, put these to this level. If the water gets below a certain point, change this to this. When the drought ends, put it to this. And then it just it just automatically runs. I keep meaning to go look at it. <laughs> and then another one I've seen too is ladders. So instead of steps, it just hooks onto the side. Makes this so much easier. Nice. You can ladder here, ladder up here, and get up things so much quicker. That one might be a little. A little cheaty. Just a little bit. We have no food. What is going on? Yikes. That's not good. We're about to have an issue. We good? Are we not good? I thought those were the presets that we had. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Whoa! This one's tough because your entire, there's so many water sources up there. Have we looked at how many water sources are up there yet, guys? And then all of it's coming through here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine water sources up there. So you gotta be you gotta be on top of it. And you know, I may have taken two of its outlets out, so 
maybe not not the best idea okay just kidding I still want the water to come through here so So we got, there we go, we got the fluid, fluid, we got the food planted, it looks like, should be getting things going, hopefully. We do need to get some bakeries going. Do we want to put those over here? Mm. I feel like maybe that's an up here item. It doesn't take power. And I don't want it to be in the way of green space where we can be growing things. So, wheat flour, tain, recipe bread, recipe bread. How far will you cut down? Whatever you don't cut down, we are going to get rid of. I want to put a storage up here for bread. The way it's at least close. And then maybe we can put a little small one over here we can obtain it and keep a little stock of it over here it's what 30 Be cutting it close on food here for a minute. Yikes, yikes, yikes. I think we'll get through it though. Can we not reach those last two? We cannot. I think that's a perfect spot for a water pump. Maybe some wet fur. Wet fur was one of the things we need more of. Injury. It was definitely one of the things we needed. A little wet fur action over here. Because why not? Some of these beavers over here can get a wet fur action. We're doing up here. We do not have 250 yet. It's for 500. Ugh. I want the triples so then we can drain every last bit of water. And honestly, if we stop this up, Instead of the water having to go all the way around here, we stop that up and the water comes over here. Then it's only making two rotations and we're cutting a lot of, a lot of length out of 
the water getting down to us. Not a bad, not a bad idea. These gears, see, I think it's time to get rid of these. Don't need you anymore, don't need you anymore. How much longer do we have on these? Can we get you going, please? Because we have no food. You guys remember when I, you know, deleted all of these berries over here? Probably when not, not the best idea. A little bit of taters there. Oh look, we're using using all of the paths. I like it. I like it. Berries seem to be keeping us alive. Two jobs. Well, I wanted to make some more housing, but if, if we don't have, um, we don't have any food, it's probably not a smart idea. I'm going to build two little storages here. Do some more bread. I utilize our space. Bit more efficiently. Hopefully we have some some bread flying in. I think of this is really gonna start helping. Probably should have done this a lot sooner, but you know. What can we do? I think these little guys are the ones we gotta delete. We can have something to do. Cool. Then we should have all of this space to do what we want. Nice. Are we looking on wet fur? Look at that. Campfire needs. Have one campfire. That's probably why. Um, hmm. I mean, you probably could get one in up here somewhere. Get our beavers a little happier. Go this way and up, so... Where do we want to put this? Um, I don't know. I want to develop this a little bit more before we get another campfire down. We're not hurting on our wellness. Sunflower seeds. That's an easy one. Hmm. Got enough wood. Bad tide approaching. We finally get to test it out. Let's see how it goes. We really have to pay attention because if we get bad water in here, uh, we gotta flush all of this out. We will not have water. Hoping our system here works. Two fifty, we can get the. Scavenger flag.
Nice. Start getting some scrap metal in. Start being able to produce that. You can unlock that though, which is 300. All right, so everything gets shut up. This gets dropped all the way down. Bad water should come in and out. Shouldn't have any overflow. We should be all good. Fingers crossed. Here we go. We got some carrots coming in. Food's doing okay. Potatoes are doing okay. How are we looking here? 93%. Think. I think we start looking at another house. There, it's going to take a step here and here. Oh, can't do that. Takes a step here. First time I do this is always a always a goof in there. And then the house, we should be able to put the house just like so. I feel like we're about to have food getting figured out. So I'm confident to put in. <laughs> now I say this, and the bad tide could come and wreck. Just wreck everything. Getting close, getting close. Might start shutting some some water down. Let's get you open. You're closed. Let's make sure we get this filled up. We had about half a tile, I think it looks like there. Top one's full, so I'm not worried about that. So these two closed up. Let's let's pause. Let's <laughs> let's make sure we don't mess anything up here. Closed. Why are you not synchronized? Good. You're all closed. You're all open. Wheat's ready to harvest. Okay. No beavers are getting in there. So the only thing I'm worried about is there being too much and it overflowing into here, which I don't think it should be any more than the water flow, um, but we're going to find out. These couple trees here might die. Um, it's got like a six or seven tile radius. So... Yeah. Doing good so far. Doing good, doing good. I think 
think we're going to be okay. I, I think we're good. Pretty positive. Pretty cool. I love how they, they made this look. Got some new beavers coming. Everything should be good. Want to empty that out. I think that's our only gear storage. Which I do want to change to over here. We got bad water yet? Oh, we do. Look. Oh, it's not even affecting over here. Nice. Look at this. Solid. And then we'll just have to keep everything kind of closed up until... Turn two of these off. All of the... The bad water runs through. We should be good. Let's plant a couple more trees up here. Got the room. We don't need any more workers up here because we're keeping up. We just we don't have storage. Nice. Nice. Let's get, let's get at least one of these working. Some flour, nice. Get some bread. Switch over to harvesting. I want all of this harvested. Oh, we got this, guys. We got this. I'm going to build storage for our scrap. And that's going to supply. Should probably build a log little log over here as well. Logs, and we're going to obtain that way because we use logs for fuel over here. That way, whatever these guys need, they should just hop between these two. And then if they have to dump off bread, it's right there as well. Instead of running all the way. Should be good. So that's empty. Good. Boom. Ears. Nice. A little slow. How are we looking? 112. That's a little, a little light. Get some more wind power going. That'll use not gears. I thought this used gears. Well, well that's unfortunate. Yeah, man. Wow. Unfortunately, everything up here is dead now. Uh, if we want any of it. We are going to have to uh, replant it. Everything on the map is officially dead. We are the only survivors. We 
get so much wood backed up. Can we try to come down here and start doing what I was talking about with... Locking these up. It's going to be a big one here. Ooh. You. Let's maybe think about this one a little bit. I guess we could do something like that. Then we wouldn't need this one. Close those in. Then we get a triple floodgate. We'd have to, so be a double. Something like that there, and then something like that here. Once we unlock the triple floodgates, boom. Nice irrigation channel here. Uh, uh, let's work on getting down. I want to get down here. This looks like a solid path. And then we'll come up right about here. We're going to need an up there. Hello. How's that one so we can build? Shouldn't need this one, actually. Yeah. Boom. Kaboom. We doing? We get through. F, okay. All right, so this goes down to it's at least one. This comes down to half. You come down to a half, and you come down to a half. Are we going to flood ourselves again? I think we figured it out this time. Thing to do in rain. Well, guy, it looks like your job is officially ended. Oh, look at the bread stocking up. Heck yeah, I'd love to see it. Maybe put you guys back on planting. Get too crazy here. Wheat flour, wheat flour stocking up. A little bit, not too much. Food's getting sorted out. Got anybody over here yet? Nope. Not at all. Love when our wood's getting backed up like that. Means we can get on some some projects. Did I goof here? Sure did. Sure did. 
So with the bad water taken care of, um, as far as downstream like this, we don't have to worry about bad water getting here. So any crops or anything we plant around here should not have to worry about any type of contamination. Yeah, so our water is going to be up to here. All of this can be crops, which will be nice. Which will be nice. We should be able to get like good arc here. We can do some buildings and stuff back in here. Be real nice. But today's a short day, guys. We're going to wrap it up there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Have a good rest of your day today. Have a good week. Um, and we'll see you again next weekend. Till then, though, guys, take care.